Scott Williamson, the director of the Virginia Chorale, is with me today to talk about Alleluia, carols around the world, the upcoming holiday concerts by the Virginia Chorale, December 3rd, 4th, and 5th. We'll give you further details on times and places in just a couple of minutes, but right now we want to talk about music. Carols from around the world, I guess Scott gives you just a wealth of material to pick and choose from, doesn't it? Well, it does. It does. One of the things we're highlighting all season long is our commitment to both the the wonderful tradition of choral music that stretches back to the Middle Ages uh, and then the, the wonderful music that's being written today and has been written recently. Uh, there's been kind of a choral musical renaissance literally around the, the world. Uh, so it's it's very exciting, and so we're discovering choral arrangements of pieces uh, from almost every corner. Uh, so we're starting uh, with a wonderful uh, song of praise from Kenya, actually, mm. uh, a Christmas hymn called Natufu Rahi Sika Yaleo. Actually, I say we're starting. We're actually prefacing that with a, with a, a piece that embodies both of the, both halves of our commitment to the old and the new, and it's a new arrangement of the wonderful Advent and, and Christmas hymn, Lo How a Rose Air Blooming. Uh, you'll hear one one half of the choir singing that hymn as as uh, music lovers know it, and then the other half of the choir creates this very beautiful and uh, atmospheric impression of just, you know, perhaps what a starry night might hmm. sound like wonderful, wonderful. Uh, by the yeah. Swedish composer Jan Sandström. So okay. it's a Sandström Pretorius right. uh, juxtaposition. Yeah, so. um, the, the thing about this sort of program is that it really does uh, get us out of that uh, very lovely English-American tradition that we all know and love, but there are some real jewels out there sure. that uh, we don't yeah. often hear. Right, right. And we'll be we'll be interspersing the wonderful mm-hmm. you know British Isles and American hymns, and there'll be some opportunities for the audience to sing along as well. Um, but yeah, we've got we've, we're also discovering, and, and the singers are are loving the music that's being written uh, in the Nordic and Scandinavian countries. Mm-hmm. So we have a, a, a set of, of Marian antiphons, hymns devoted to the Virgin Mary. Uh, we're doing the Magnificat of Arvo Pert, which is uh, one of the singer's favorite pieces. And it's also one, an, an audience favorite as well. We hear every time we program Pert, oh, I love that music. Yeah. Something very special yeah. about it uh, that sounds somewhat timeless. Yeah, it's it's got an archaic sound to it, and yet it's, yeah. it's right up to date. Yeah, it, it exactly. bridges both yeah. uh, traditions. So we're doing two, two Arvo Pert settings, very, very different, this very austere Magnificat, and then this very ebullient uh, carol setting of the Russian Orthodox Bogorodice Dievo, an Ave Maria, basically, that was written for uh, King's College for their uh, service of lessons and carols. We're doing the original version of Franz Bibel's Ave Maria, uh, yes. uh, the great uh, German composer that's that's been neglected, and he has this all-male, seven-part, double-male chorus mm. uh, version of Ave Maria. A lot of church choirs and community choirs do the mixed choral version that, that involves a, a, a Sopranos and altos, obviously, uh, but it's wonderful to hear our, our men singing mm. this piece. I think that will be a real favorite. We're talking about Alleluia, carols around the world, the offering for this holiday season by the Virginia Chorale, December 3rd at First Presbyterian Church, 8 p.m. in Virginia Beach, and December 4th, Christ and St. Luke's Church in Norfolk, and then the Sunday matinee, December 5th at the Williamsburg Presbyterian Church. Three fine venues acoustically, right? Yes, we are excited about uh, this weekend, and and we know that uh, we'll be in Williamsburg the day of the grand illumination, so we're Uh, hopeful that folks will come early, park their cars, have a nice relaxing lunch, come hear some wonderful music. Uh, in, including a new carol written for us by John Dixon, oh, great, a wonderful great. setting of an old French tune uh, th- that he's uh, translated into English, "Twas in a Lowly Stable, mm. uh, and he's written it with our voices in mind, so there's some wonderful harmonies in there. Uh, wonderful. Uh, so yeah, we're John, excited about John this. is very much uh, interested in, in especially the liturgical music for the holidays. Yeah, he's done yeah. several settings of, yeah. of those a, sorts a, of things. Yeah, it's a great song, and then we're, we're ending with uh, a a couple of new arrangements, a wonderful, kind of somewhat jazzy arrangement of Silent Night that's become both a singer and an audience favorite. It was written for the Swedish uh, small vocal ensemble, The Real Group, mm-hmm. uh, by Anders Jalkas. And uh, then we're ending with a little spoof 
uh, on Christmas, if you will. It's a piece called uh, Christmas Pudding that one of my colleagues referred to referred me to. It's by Jonathan Wilcox, the son of, of Sir David, David Wilcox. And in it, in the span of about four minutes, uh, Jonathan makes fun of about two dozen different uh, carols. So if you didn't hear your favorite Christmas carol uh, in the first 70 minutes of the program, well, you're, you'll hear it in the last five, It'll basically. Zip by. <laughs> exactly. And it's a lot of fun, uh, yeah. so some serious fun, actually. Right. A little levity is always good in these sorts of yeah, concerts. Yeah, it is. And you, that is the singers, will be singing all these in the original languages, won't they? For the most part. We're going to do infant holy, infant lowly in English rather than Polish. Okay. But <laughs> other than that, right. Okay. Other than that. All right. Well, a fine concert again, and it's, it really is uh, one of the ways that, that really ushers in the season. When the Virginia Chorale does its holiday concert, you know we're getting close. So That's right. We're looking forward to it. Uh, three performances again Friday night, December 3rd at First Presbyterian Church in Virginia Beach. That's 8 p.m. Saturday evening, the 4th, Christ and St. Luke's Church in Norfolk. Sunday at the Williamsburg Presbyterian Church. That's a 4 p.m. concert. Alleluia, carols around the world, with Scott Williamson conducting the Virginia Chorale. Scott, thank you very much. Thank you, Dwight. Great to be here. Thank you.